is going on family all right good morning everyone welcome back to the channel i appreciate you guys for tuning in bringing you guys a full day of eating today on the refeed so if you guys were here for the last video you know that i was low carb all week sent my coach my check-ins he was like bro looking crazy shredded so today we get a refeed we also did refeed yesterday which was monday so today is tuesday we get a tuesday refeed as well i have a leg day today one of the last leg days of prep actually now that i think about it i think i have like three leg days left so we have a leg day today which is gonna be all right but then tomorrow's shoulder day is gonna go crazy with this double refeed back to back so as you guys saw in the morning i was too tired to be talking first thing in the morning that wasn't happening but like i was saying i came out of a low carb week all week and i literally have to talk while i eat this because i have been craving this fucking rice for so long but all that refeed was was my exact same meal plan but i got two bagels and i got an extra serving of cream of rice that's it that's all the refeed was so i went from having like 2571 calories 2571 into a refeed today or excuse me into a refeed yesterday and today at 3300 calories approximately so back to back days 3300 calories i woke up 162.4 yesterday morning pre-refeed did the refeed yesterday woke up today 162.8 so 0.4 pounds up which is totally expected but right on point i feel full i'm much more energized so we're on point right now i'm eating 225 grams of rice six ounces of flex pro chicken code ian if you guys want to run it up such a convenience factor when you're on prep and then i also have we also got 60 grams of sunflower kernels my go-to fat of choice so i'm gonna crush this this is essentially our pre-workout meal i have one more bagel that i'll have what time is it it's 9 45 in the morning right now i'll have one more bagel before my workout later on as a pre-workout snack and that'll be it so i'll check in with you guys when we get the bagel here's how we're looking first thing in the morning i showed you guys kind of when i was making my uh, breakfast shake ignore my uh Oh, shit. oh man all right so get that done get this meal down enjoy it and then i'll check in with you guys for the pre-workout bagel so nuts in a cup baby nuts in a cup all right, time for some pre-workout bagels all right that's good enough i'll take it all right time to make some bagels so i don't have a toaster so i have to put my bagels in the oven which is annoying but it's all good also, I don't care to do it for the video because I'm just gonna be quick with it, but I've been scaling my bagels to see which one weighs the most. Usually they're always the same, but one time it'll be like, you know, one will be like 105, one will be like 97, so you know I'm going with the 105. But yeah, since I don't have a toaster, I have to put these in the oven. Ignore my ridiculous fit I have on right now. We're not gonna talk about it. And then what I like to do to give you guys a little prep secret so here, on top of my bagels, I'll use this, can't believe it's not butter, uh, spray, which I'll probably cut out here in like a week, um, zero calorie. And then I like to sprinkle just a little bit of Splenda, and then I top it off with some ground Q cinnamon, I almost said cumin. Sprinkle a little of this on top of there, it tastes super good. <laughs> when I get super, super crazy, I'll put a little bit of this in my hand, right? This is like dessert. This is dessert on prep. Spray just a little bit of this spray and then you sprinkle. <laughs> this is fucking psycho. You sprinkle on a little cinnamon. Look at that. You got dessert on prep. Tasty. What I did not show was every morning before I eat, I'm going to drink a scoop of the Project 80 Good Morning. This stuff right here is a game changer. Apple cider vinegar, glutamine, all in one. Never have to buy them again. Kill two birds, kill three birds with one stone. And I'm also gonna take all my morning supplements, vitamin C, vitamin D, krill oil, digestive support, liver, kidney support, all right here. My bagel! Alrighty, bagel, good to go. This is how we're gonna do it. We're gonna go a little bit of spray, a little bit of Splenda. Splenda causes cancer. Yeah, fuck off. And then, so that is gonna be our pre-workout snack. Let's get it. All right, we're gonna eat this. I might film a little bit of the workout, but other than that, I'll check in with you guys after. 
We get carbs today, baby. We get carbs today. Alrighty family, we are back post gym. Hope you guys are doing well. I know I am because I have carbs in me today. Mm. So after the gym, mm. hold on. Oh my God. So after the gym, included in my refeed today is the two bagels that I had. And then I also have a serving of cream of rice after the gym. That's what I showed you guys. I'm sorry if this video has been a little weird and kind of janky. Today's been a super off day. I actually just got news that I got dropped from my sponsor. So last video I was promoting the drop and this video I got dropped. So it is what it is. Um, as one door closes, another door opens, but I definitely did not expect that to happen waking up today. So I'm sorry if this video is kind of weird. Um, yeah, so after the gym, we had that serving of cream of rice. On my normal diet plan, I also have 60 grams of quick oats. So I had 30 in the morning in that shake that I showed you guys. I'll have 30 post-workout. Um, I had the cream of rice, so I'll probably have the oats just a little later. But right now, we're eating six ounces of salmon. I have another 30 grams of sunflower kernels and then 225 grams of rice. This is going to be our post-post-workout meal, and then I'll have one more meal on the night, plus those oats. But yeah, that's pretty much it on the refeed. Essentially, the refeed is the exact same thing as my meal plan. I just get two bagels, and I get cream of rice. So, that's where we're at. I always eat the rice first. Some people like to mix the two. I love the carbs so much, I just need the rice by itself. I'm gonna crush this, and then I'll tune in to you guys when we eat the oats. Adios. And we are back with our 30 grams of quick oats. So like I said, I have 60 grams of quick oats on the day. I had 30 in the morning and then I had that serving of cream of rice, which was part of the refeed. And then I'm having the last 30. Um, and then after this, that's pretty much gonna do it for the night. I'm gonna have my final meal. And my final meal isn't even a um, like a refeed meal. It's just like my standard plan meal, which is 300 grams of potatoes and six ounces of ground beef. So gonna crush this, enjoy it, and then yeah, I'll see you guys soon. This doesn't even have protein in it. I literally just took a, it's not bad. I took um, stevia and some ground cinnamon and that was it. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Yeah, but there you go. That's about it gonna crush this and then get after it so i'll see you guys soon oh yeah all righty what is going on family as i said final meal of the night in our absurdly large cool whip container is going to be 300 grams of red potatoes and then we got our six ounces of ground beef Oh no, <laughs> oh no. All right, <laughs> I might just let that rock. And then we also have six ounces of ground beef. This is gonna be our final meal of the night. There is no fats with this meal. And this is also just a normal planned meal. Like this isn't my refeed or anything like that. So normal intake for the rest of the night. We're gonna kill this final meal of the night. I'll throw up the calories on the screen for you guys. I think we're at like just approximately 3,300 calories. But like I said, I'll throw that up there so you guys can see it. But other than that, man, that's pretty much going to wrap it up. I didn't film any of the workout for you guys. Today was fucking brutal. It was one of the last leg workouts of prep and everything felt so heavy. It was awful. Um, I mean, it was a good workout. I still worked hard, but felt super hard. It was all right, but tomorrow is going to be exciting. We have shoulders tomorrow. A workout after two full days of high carb. Going to feel really good. So really excited for that. As you can tell, 